So I'm a cardiologist. I did my medical training here originally in Adelaide. I uh, did a PhD looking at the good form of cholesterol. And then after that I had the opportunity to go to the United States to work at the Cleveland Clinic, which is one of the very large hospitals in the United States that looks after heart disease. And uh, I was there for eight years. Uh, I spent a lot of time doing a wide range of research. We did some research in the lab itself using kind of cells and beakers and those types of things, all the way through to leading very large scale clinical trials of, of new therapies. I developed a, a kind of a keen interest in heart disease early on. This is a, a disease that is very common in our society and you know the, the really good thing is over the last two or three decades that we've been able to develop a whole bunch of different ways of treating heart disease. As good as the treatments we currently have are, we need to do even better and so I got very interested in trying to find better ways that we could treat heart disease, detect heart disease, try and predict somebody's risk that they would have a, you know, a, a, a need to come to hospital or whatever so that we could intensify their treatments. SAMRI was something that was very exciting to me. It was uh, a great opportunity and in fact an opportunity that you don't really see happening anywhere else in the world. Uh, you have this brand new building uh, and a brand new institute and it's bringing together everybody. It's bringing together all the universities, all the hospitals in the state. It's a great opportunity to bring together all the researchers and to bring them under one roof and, and hopefully by doing that we really can then stimulate those researchers to not only do the best research that they're doing already but hopefully stimulate them to work together in ways that they wouldn't have thought so previously so that we can be really innovative. Uh, and I like the idea of what Samri was trying to do in terms of building that. We've got a lot of work to do. We've uh, got to uh, bring the talent that's already in South Australia together. And, and, and when I say South Australia, I think that we really want to embrace cardiovascular research throughout the state, not just in Adelaide. We want to bring together researchers from all walks of life, whether you're somebody that exclusively works in the lab bench uh, with cells, or whether you're somebody that is in the hospital system uh, and, and your, your job is to basically look after patients. We want to bring those people together and we want them to kind of think out of the box uh, and, and really start kind of coming up with the kinds of ideas that really change the way that we treat patients, that we prevent disease. That's what SAMRI is ultimately about. We're right on the edge of being able to get new cutting edge ways of detecting the disease, predicting the risk that you'll have a heart attack and ultimately treating the disease that you know one day this may actually be a curable condition. We want South Australia to be the kind of place that people are going to want to come to and I think SAMRI provides that opportunity. Our ultimate aim is not that this just becomes the jewel in the crown for research in Adelaide, not just in Australia, but really this is an opportunity for SAMRI to be on the world stage, to be a major player in heart disease research moving forward. Uh, we have a lot of work, we have a lot of support, uh, we can't wait to get work started.